Yo, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video of Los Angeles Charger franchise. We are here in week eight. Or let's say week seven. But I just remember we had a bye week. We're here in week eight. Almost said it again. We're here week eight. After picking up a win against the Jets, maybe? I don't remember our last game. No Patriots. 30. Yeah, we're kind of beating teams by a lot this season. Only close game we had was against the Bengals. And that wasn't even fairly close. Like, I don't think we need to make a lot of I just think we're playing really good. I think we're a good defensive team, honestly. I think we figured everything we had to figure out. We, we obviously struggle sometimes with offense. You can see that. If you are new here, consider hitting that subscribe button. Easy way to support the channel other than liking the video. And I want to check standings. How are we looking in terms of the whole NFL? So I see a lot of good teams this season in the NFL in general. Bucks are good. Packers are good. Bills are... We're the only loss. Wow, that's interesting. And, yeah, the rest of the teams are, like, kind of, eh. It is early in the season, so a lot could change within the next few weeks. We're at top of the AFC. Wow, Bills are, we really, are the only Bills lost. That's crazy. That's crazy. Depending on how this game goes, I will make slot change. I, I always say that, like. I don't always say it, but I've been saying that for the past few weeks. I'm thinking about making a playbook change, but I am not sure about that yet. I'm really not sure if we should make a playbook change just yet. Because I think, like, this playbook, I'm running Saints playbook, I believe, and it just doesn't have the passing plays I want. I think it has good running plays, but just uh, the passing plays are just not it in a way. But anyways, um, breakout player. Let's see what this is. Is a defensive player. Trayvon Tapp. Really? I mean, this could be huge. Because let's say he does have star dev. This now boosts him to superstar. Let's see, he has superstar. This now boosts him to superstar X Factor. So regardless of what he has, this is huge for him. Hold the Broncos 200 yards or get Trayvon Hep. Two in toes, two tackles for loss, or two forced fumbles. I read that kind of wrong, but you get the point. Interesting. I thought it was going to be Kareem Hunt, which I was hoping it would be Kareem Hunt. Um, wow, all right. Uh, obviously, injury decisions. Trading, not trading, contracts. That's what it is. I said injury, trading, everything else except contracts. So I said we're going to let Eli Apple walk for sure. Alex Kappa, you're also 28. You probably will be good to resign for another year, maybe two, but you're also not progressing in the way you need to heading into your 30s. So I can't really do that. Eric Jones is probably a no. You're going to ask for like a mill over... Like a year young, but then again, no. And I feel like every, we had Eric Jones for years now. I feel like we had him for two years already. And he's been hidden dead for two years. Tom Brady wants to resign for another year. We might actually do that. I might consider doing that just just, just, just for the last. So the person we're really focused on is Cesar Ruiz. He wants two years 15. I think we can give him the two years 15. Nah, I gotta, I'm gonna just give you two and like boost up a little bit. I'm gonna give you 15 mil. Two years, 15 mil. 15 over two. There's many ways I could word this. Except the contract. He would like to play for a new team next year. Bro, I was giving you more than you was asking for. Like way more. Okay, maybe not way more, because you was asking for it. You wanted your salary to be 8.2. And your, your signing bonus to be 6. Yeah, I wasn't... I don't think I was doing that. We're probably going to franchise tag him, depending on what the franchise tag is for uh, right tackles. Depending. If it's more than what he's acting for, I'm going to let him walk and then try to sign him a free agency. So, I guess we don't really got to worry about contracts anymore. Um, like I said, this is a trade deadline. I don't think I'm going to trade anybody. Cream Hunt and Quentin Nelson's are our only upgrades in this episode. 
I just wish Kareem Hunt would have got the the dev up. I really wish he did. It was some sudden 93 overall. My TV is very loud. He gets plus three to spin move, change direction, break, tackle, and awareness. So what are your spin moves now? 83? Yep, spin moves on 83. These are really good stats. I wish his speed would go up a little bit more. Um, yeah, if he gets like to 94 his speed, I mean, he's already like kind of fast, but he's not as fast as I want him to be. It doesn't really matter what we go, we go agile. You're already a beast as it is. Just look at his stats. Not stats, not abilities. Ratings. I'm saying the wrong words too many times today. He's he's already so good. Sometimes you do miss your blocks, but that's just a Madden thing more than that's a you thing. We're 87 over there, 82. They're just not very good. Just as soon as actually uh, one of the Superstar X Factor. That's actually pretty cool. Deep zone KO, medium KO. Damn, you, you're actually pretty good. Wow, that's actually not nice. That's a nice ability. They also have Cortland Sutton, Bradley Chubb. And Drew Locke actually got a superstar. I don't think he should have that. I'm not going to lie. Nah, he really should not have that. That's a... All right, whatever. It doesn't even matter. It doesn't matter. We are playing in Broncoville, as I called it last time. <laughs> We're playing in Denver. Let me not ever say Broncoville ever again. I'm going to just erase that from my vocabulary and act like I never said it. We just found out Drew Locke has a superstar f uh, ability. I must be superstar factor. He has superstar ability, which he really shouldn't have, but whatever. It's, it's like he has quick draw and roaming dead eye. Whatever. Nothing too crazy, but still. Why does he have an ability? We, we, we had trouble with this team in the past, but that's only because of uh, Melvin Gordon. And as you see, Kareem Hunt, the likely MVP, five out of his six games, or four out of his five games, he's had over 100 rushing yards. So... Which means he only missed one game without ha eclipsing over 100 rushing yards. And that's MVP numbers right there. And that means he has to have over, like, 500 yards, right? Technically, in a way, he has to have close 500 yards or 500 yards. Drew Lock makes his way to the field. We'll see what type of stats he's putting up this season. Not bad. 1,500, 11 touchdowns, 5 interceptions. Pretty cool. Pretty nice. That was me. Is that Melvin Gordon they have? Is he back? At that time, it definitely was a shot penny. Come here. Beautiful. Beautiful way to seek out that tackle. Yeah, they do have Melvin Gordon back. He wasn't playing last season almost at all. I don't even know what that was about, but that's why they were so easy for us to beat last season, because they didn't have him. Justin Herbert, who is having a little bit of pick issues, just a little bit. It's nothing, like, crazy, but it is coming back. 1,500 yards, 13 touchdowns, and 7 interceptions. I need to not get that inception rate into double digits this season. Which means I only could throw like three more inceptions if I don't want to get into double digits. Which is probably going to be hard to do. Alright, we that was supposed to be like a two yard gain in turn to six. Nice broken tackle. Nobody's really blitzing. If we get some blocks off, we definitely could get this. You're in my way, bro. Oh, my gosh. Either be faster than me or get the fuck out the way. And now we're definitely passing. They are blitzing, so... This could be open over the middle. Or oh, this could be open. Hunter. I was fucking possessioning it. Oh, come on, bro. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. Melvin Gordon. The man with no ability, but he played like a Super X Factor. Oh my god, you guys are playing so off, it's annoying. Big hit. He might have got a cross for that first. He actually didn't. I actually want to send a heavy blitz at them on this. Big hit again. Just come on, man. How did he get through on that? Oh, let's go, Kenneth. All the way. No way Drew Lock is faster. I was about to say, there's no way Drew Lock is faster. Big play. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Third inception of the season. Big play. This is what our defense is all about. Big stops. Read that perfectly. To the house. So I'm putting up seven to zip so far early in this game. It's early in this first quarter. It's pretty late in the first quarter. But it's early in this game though. I love these uniforms that I chose. I like theirs a little bit a little bit too. But they're just a little bit too light for me. Good shit, Joey. Out of the tackle for loss. Just a no gainer, I think. Oh, might actually be a tackle for loss. Interesting. I didn't think it would be. So now we got two people in the zone. How do y'all let that. Oh my god, bro. Good tackle, uh, Drew. Is that Drew? No, oh, that's actually Matt Bryant. Interesting. That's a name we just don't see a lot. Well, at least getting, like, sacks and shit like that. All right. They go short. Seems like that's all they're doing today. They kind of go... The deepest they kind of go is, like, 10 yards at least. Which is not horrible, but it's like... You kind of could be deeper on that. Nobody's open. Can we get to him? Thank you. Did he throw that? No, that's a sack. Nice. Good shit, General Russell. There we go. I had someone chase me from behind. Do they still have, um... What's this dude's name? Von Miller? I don't, I don't see him on the floor. The floor. That's... Okay. I'm pretty sure we were down. What is the fact that we didn't get that? Is that that's just a good problem. Big hit out of bounds. Oh my god, there's no way. Please catch him. Okay. Uh, they played like it was a man. It definitely was not man. Was it? Actually, might have been. I did blitz. All right. <laughs> I'm like, maybe we did play man on that one. I don't know. I don't feel like this will work, but that's how I feel most of the time. Block right there. Why are you blocking inside? I'm moving to the outside. Wow, that's his first completion. That is ridiculous for to be your first completion, bro. Big. Let's go, Hunter. Looking for that contact. We gotta get these this passing moving, bro. He has 14 yards right now. Not cool. Let's go. Almost getting that first with uh, Ronald Jones. All right, 
right, that was annoying. Field goal most likely. Yeah, 56 yarder. A little bit of wind pushing back. Accurate. And that's going to be 10 to 7. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with us on offense. Uh, we don't have a lot of passing yards. Kind of any. We're kind of a return us up to a run heavy team. Good tackle. It's a tackle for loss. Kenneth Murray doing a lot today. That's not a tackle for loss, really? How is it going to be a pass? Please do not give anything big. And we give up that. Uh, it's kind of me. I should be covering those underneath. Big hit. That was the Mario on that one. Big hit again. We're hitting them very hard, but they're just not fumbling, bro. Good spot to go in. Not gonna lie, it's a very good spot. Big hit. There's no way he really holds on to that, man. That's so annoying. Good D. What's the flag? Roughing the passer? Are you serious? What I want to, well, when I actually want you to run, rush the passer, yeah, I never get in. Somehow, yeah, just never get in, though. That's just crazy to me. Oh, what a fucking sack. Let's go, fellas. Put him out of range. No, no. God damn it, man. Fuck. I probably should have ran zone, but I felt like man coach was the move, bruh. It's just a bigger target. Uh, defender couldn't locate the ball. I already know what to do when he had it. It's like, ugh. We got to get points right here, man. Right before half, getting points would be huge. I a screen. I don't really like this. doesn't really work out for the first play on me. Actually works out that time. Got a bounce. Good speed right there. Four for seven, 38 yards in the first half. There we go. Getting out of bounds. Nice, nice way to get to midfield in two plays. Just like that. There we go. Call another timeout. Bro, there's nowhere to go with the ball. I got hit pretty hard on that one. Ah, fuck. I'm going to have to hit a field goal anyways. There's no point of spiking. Alright, we'll take a field goal. We'll take a field goal. It's not that bad. Touchdown wasn't like a do or die type of thing. All right, it's going to put us 13 to 14. We do get ball at half, so I'm not too mad at that. Probably could have took some better shots um, once we got near the end zone. But it's all right. There's nothing too hard. We still end up with points, so I'm not mad at all. All right, second half time. We got to be a little bit more aggressive on offense. A little bit more aggressive. We're kind of being too um, conservative in a way. We're like running the ball a little too much. We're not, we're not going after it enough. I think we all know that. That that was a very good juke, though. That was a very good juke. Looks like we will. Yep. 
That play always works for some reason. Back at it. Ah, oh, come on. A little, little too far. A little too far, man. So, literally, two things could be open here. It's either going to be Hunter Henry or Ronald Jones. Hunter Henry. Good catch. Beautiful catch. Simple reads. You see everybody blitzing? All right. Two two reads. Which one are you going to go for? Because you can't co cover both. I swear to God, if you would have covered both, I would have. Last video of the series. No more Madden for me. What a catch. What a catch. Put us up. Put us it up. <laughs> Putting us up 21 to 14. I almost said 21 to 4. That's a weird score. Very good catch. He usually never catches. Well, lately, he has been kind of catching those, but I do throw that ball a lot. So he hasn't really been catching those. Tag for loss for Drew. Should be. I'm stuck on a line. I'm stuck on a line. Oh my gosh. <laughs> One of you had to make a play on the ball somehow, bro. Good tap. I hate broken tackles because they happen too often. Good fucking play. Good fucking play. They almost actually got that. Are they gonna hit this? It's not that far with Phil, though. I mean, we hit Phil close from this far before. And they're not <laughs> at all. They do not have the leg for that. And we can take a, not commanding lead, but we could extend this game a little bit further with uh, some points right here. There we go, Kareem. 13 rushes, 71 yards. Blocks looking good. Runs looking good. Kareem looking good. <laughs> oh my god, that's how that just sound like I was cutting a promo. Lock the middle. Everything else should be good. Got the first. Should not be inches. Bruh, I'm literally across, like fully across. Like, the fact that you're saying no is ridiculous. There we go. Like, come on. Good catch, Dorian. Really? <laughs> like, I'm saying, he, he's playing like a game-managing quarterback right now. Which is not horrible, because if you have a good running back, why not? I, I don't have a problem with that. If you have a good running back that could get you constant first downs, get you constant spots, why not just, hey, I'm going to just dump it off every now and then. This might be a Hunter Henry throw. Really? A lot of contact, but we'll just, uh, we'll just kick the field goal. Be smart about it. No reason to go for it. It's going to be 23-14. Um, I mean, you know, yeah, just her really like a game managing quarterback right now, man. It's, it's like you hate to see it, but it's like, hey, it is what it is, man. They're actually running. No, they're not. They're not. They're not. They're not. Get up. He holds on to that. That's me. I never hold on to that. I just couldn't get in, and he is gone. Is he? Oh, good tackle, Derwin. Fuck, bro. Come here. Tackle for loss. Yup.
come on, you gotta let like he has to pop. Did we really jump off sides? We actually got the touchdown. Yeah, it's gonna be off sides. That touchdown is gonna stand. I, I seen him. I seen him. It's gonna be twenty-one to twenty-four. I want to twenty-one twenty fourteen for some reason. Mine is going places where it's not supposed to go. Good catch. Really good catch. I was looking for a deep shot, but these people just were coming off the edge merciful. Alright, I'm not about to say what I was going to say because words are hard. There we go. Kareem. Another game with over 100 rushing yards. I would say easily, but it wasn't always easy. You know, sometimes the runners just aren't there. Sometimes they just really are. There we go again. Oh, you have to be kidding me. Where's the blocks? I'm blocking almost everybody on the line. The only person I said that was on the line was Hunter. And now we're out of the zone. Fucking great. I love it. I don't hate one thing about this. I'm not gonna lie. This looks like a play where Cream Hunt can get open. Nope. Oh, I could have probably. Nah, that was, that was a good, that's a smart one. Possession was a smart call. Uh, we've kind of put True Clock on now. Uh. I love when I say we only gain such and such, and I get that amount right. Makes me feel like I know what I'm talking about. Because, oh, let me tell you, I have no idea what I'm talking about sometimes. That could have been a um, strip sack. Cream Hunt actually fumbled the ball like that a couple years ago. Well, actually, probably, yeah, probably maybe two years ago at this point. No one's blitzing. All right, something should get open, right? There we go. Yep, easy. Let's go. I don't think Trayvon Tapp is going to get that breakout player. But we still had a good game. Well, game's not over. We're still having a good game. I'm actually glad we're able to run the ball now because now I, I just feel more, I feel better about my chances with a lot of things. Cause I know I could pass the ball. Like, I know that. But when I'm able to run the ball, it just feels wonderful. Really? Was that necessary? Oh, that's your screen. I was on the other side of the field, not paying attention. There we go. It's probably going to be game over. Get up. Come on. You like sitting on the floor and shit. Yeah, we will. If we would have gained some yards on any of those runs, then we did that play, then... Yeah, we could have had a first, but no. I mean, we've seen the Titans kind of do it to us almost twice. Big hit. Can y'all fumble once? Just once. We actually got out of bounds. Pretty smart. Oh, you have brick hands, bro. That's clear as day a pick. They're kicking a... 
Okay, whatever. <laughs> they kick a field goal. That's not even close. But you know, uh, I wouldn't say Justin Herbert's not playing well. We're just not utilizing him in that way. Because we can run the ball now. Before, we wasn't utilizing Kareem Hunt. Uh, Le'Veon Bell. What's the other name? Justin Jackson. We wasn't utilizing those guys well because we just couldn't run the ball. But now, we can. We have a better offensive line that actually blocks. And we're playing better now. And we are thankful for that. I just had way more passing yards than us. We had way more rushing yards than them. Uh, we ended up winning the game. We had forcible turnovers two times, which I don't... Actually, I don't remember. We had two picks. It's actually a good game, fellas. I'm actually very proud of us. Um, I don't necessarily think we need to make slider changes, but I might now. Maybe not, because Drew Locke is not really an outstanding quarterback. Um, it's not like they wasn't running the ball good on us, as you can see. Got 317 passing yards, three touchdowns, two interceptions. Can't say he wasn't playing well. He just didn't play as other quarterbacks. Well, good as other quarterbacks did. If that if that even makes sense in, in words. Anyways, Justin Herbert, 202 yards, one touchdown. Just really wasn't, you know, he threw the ball 23 times. But, you know, it is what it is. It was just short yardage, clearly. Cream Hunt, 116 yards, another game over 100 rushing yards. No touchdowns this game, though. Touchdown actually went to Rashad Jones. Uh, Rashad Penny had a, a most... Well, he had one more carry than Melvin Gordon. And he had way more yards than Melvin Gordon in 54. So Melvin Gordon's 26. So we kind of... I want to say we shut down Melvin Gordon. I feel like Rashad um, Penny had uh, most of the carries. You know he had one more, which... I don't know if that makes sense. No offense had 135 uh, passing yards, three touchdowns. He had all three touchdowns. Next highest was uh, KJ Hamler with 75. And Dorian Dale had four catches for 72. Justin Reed had three catches for 51. Hunter Henry had uh, four catches for 31. Cream Hunt was in there too. Preston Williams. And uh, Tony Burton. I feel like we kind of hit everybody. Even though it wasn't a lot of yards, we did kind of hit everybody. Let's focus on tackles for loss. Kent Murray had four tackles for loss. Um... Richard Trent had, not Richard, Reuben Trent had two, Brad Chip had two, Sam Hubbard had one, Jerry Tilly had one, Bryce Callahan had one, Matt Bryant had one, Drew Tranquil had one, Joey Bosa had one, and uh, Ricardo Allen had one. And for Sachs, it was just Sam Hubbard, you know his name, and Shannon Rose, so Intos we know, we only had two Intos, Kendra and Junior, Sheldon Brooks. So I think Kendra Murray Jr. kind of deserves to... Uh, being a thumbnail this game. All right, that is week eight. Another victory. We didn't get the uh, breakout player. You know, I'm yeah, I'm very sad in that he didn't get it either. But it's all right. He didn't get it. That's fine. Move to seven and zero. And the weekly awards. Kenneth Murray Jr. Yes, Kenneth Murray Jr. did get it. So that could be a. Uh, I'm sure though. And I'm going to do actually to get it, so that's fun. Uh, no fan, obviously. Wouldn't say dominated us, but we ended up still winning, so. How much did he really dominate? Uh, we might have the best defense in the league, honestly. We're facing the 6-1 Packers. First time we're facing possibly Aaron Rodgers. I actually want to check what they have Aaron Rodgers on that team. I doubt they will. This is like... Four years in the future, so most likely not. Yeah, I'm not seeing him. Yeah, it's Jordan Love. Jordan Love at the helm. With who other than Josh Rosen? Not not, not a bad team, in my opinion. Pretty interesting. This will be a fun game against the Packers. We know they have uh, Aaron Jones. We know they have Devontae Adams. And probably a good defense. They are 7-0. Um, this AFC West is very... It's kind of ours in a point. In a, in a point. In a way. It's... Yeah, it's just... It's kind of locked up. Uh, can we look at awards? We can look at awards. Who's our MVP? Really? Cream Hunt is 3, though. 
Cream Hunt is three. Deshaun Watt, these teams are bad, bro. Can we, if y'all gonna base it on real life, can we actually base it on real life? Because it was real life, Kareem Hunt be on top of everybody. The only one that's there is Jordan Love, and everybody else is fucking horrible. You have Colin Kaepernick, get the fuck, okay. He's like, I bet you he's like 37 in this. He's 73 overall, and he's in MVP conversations. That is nuts, bro. Don't do that. All right, he, he, Kareem Hunt definitely might win some awards if he doesn't get injured. Like, please don't get injured. Please do not get injured. Cream Hunt already there. Defensive player of the year. Ah, we don't have a defensive player of the year. Kenneth Murray is the only one who could possibly win it. Or Drew Tranquil. I don't think we're going to get one. We don't have an offensive rookie. Do we have a defensive rookie? Not really. Well, Trayvon Hat, but he probably won't get it because his stats are just not there yet. Best QB... Just Herbert's eighth because he just he's just not putting up amazing stats. Best running back, we know who that's gonna be. Best wide receiver, we already know who that's gonna be. Best D line, Joey Bosa is two. This is the first time in some time in this uh, series that he's actually on there. Chandler Rose is actually on there too. Linebacker Kenneth Murray should be number one in my opinion. Trank was in there too. DB, yeah, none of our DBs are really playing good. Mister Adley's up there. I don't know. Let's actually check some stats. Uh, Justin Herbert not really killing the league right now. <laughs> He's barely over 2,000 yards in almost 10 games. So, uh, like, you kind of want to pick that up, but you're kind of just playing good enough. Like, that's how I feel. Cream Hunt almost has over 1,000 yards and 11 touchdowns. Receiving Dorian Dell, not really... Once again, not like our receiving stats are not really up there, but we're doing all right. And uh, tag for loss, obviously, Kenneth Martin Jr. is going to be up there. Interceptions, no, sacks. Joey Bosa already has six on the season, which is good. So he possibly could win best D lineman. Chandler also has five. Trayvon Tapp has three. So, Trayvon Tapp is having a horrible rookie season so far, but it's not ideal. Erwin James not really having a good season. No intos, no sacks. Four tackles for loss. Uh, 34 tackles, you know? Not really having a good season. We might do something to change that, but, yeah, I think that's what we're going to cover in this episode here today. So, if you did enjoy be sure, be sure to subscribe if you are not subscribed already. Like the video. And I'll see you next video. But until next video, peace. They said it's subliminal. Yeah, I'm seeing them shits. Yeah, I don't reply. Yeah, just reading them shits.